In eBeanet, we use the interaction of microbiology and engineering to develop more efficient, scalable systems for environmental biotechnology applications, like aeration. In wastewater treatment, many microbes require oxygen to break down organic matter and pollutants. To speed up this natural process, vast quantities of air are pumped into the treatment tanks, which is very energy intensive. Technological innovations, such as the use of fine bubble diffusers and high efficiency blowers, have made the process more efficient. But dissolving a gas into a liquid and delivering it to the microbes is still a relatively slow process with transfer rates proportional to the interfacial area of the bubbles. Fine bubbles with their larger surface to volume ratio can improve the transfer rate, and smaller bubbles rise more slowly, giving more time for gas to diffuse into the liquid. This is where engineering comes in. Techniques like fluidic oscillation break bubbles into smaller, more uniform sizes. This significantly enhances mass transfer getting the gas into solution where the microbes can access it, while reducing energy consumption. As they work, the microbes secrete byproducts and chemicals into the liquid. Although the quantities are small, they affect a range of properties, which have a major impact on gas transfer rates. While the microbes have food, they scavenge and consume any oxygen that is present. So there is always a strong difference in concentration to drive oxygen out of the bubble and into the liquid. The result is greater overall efficiency and a system where microbes and bubbles exist in dynamic equilibrium. Improved gas transfer has many other applications in environmental biotechnology. For example, microbubbles can extract dissolved products or remove inhibitors that could otherwise build up and prevent microbes from doing their jobs. Algae in bioreactors grow faster when more CO2 is added and gas fermentation processes benefit from better gas transfer, opening up the potential for biofuel production and carbon capture. Changing one variable in the design of these systems can unlock massive biological potential. Whether by enabling more efficient wastewater treatment or creating advanced biorefinery processes, improving mass transfer has a significant impact in environmental biotechnology applications. And as we progress to a more sustainable bioeconomy, the potential uses of our research continue to grow. Helping us work towards a better, cleaner future for humanity and the planet.